This is Stampy, and welcome to a Minecraft Let's Play video, and another video inside of Stampy's uh, lovely world. Good morning, William Beaver. Good morning. <laughs> I'll be over there in just one moment. You can go and get ready for today's games. All right then. I am, of course, as you can see, going to be joined by William Beaver. But I am not only going to be joined by a beaver. I am also going to be joined by a whatever this is <laughs> I'm gonna be joined by my friendly alien choo choo you can uh, come in here oh careful I thought you're gonna walk straight in actually if you just oh you're going through backwards okay okay if you want a challenge go through backwards <laughs> I could have been mean and shut the door then but I wasn't choo choo I wasn't <laughs> right then let's go and uh, have my breakfast shall we have had uh, another attempt at the the secret recipe and uh, let's see how it is it it smells it smells quite nice, actually. Let's see how it tastes. Nom, 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 nom. Oh, oh, it's fizzy. It's fizzy. It's a, it's a fizzy cake. Yeah, I've never had a fizzy cake before. It's quite nice. It's a, it's like, it's like sherbetty. Hmm, it's quite nice, actually. It's, hmm, it's not, it's not the kind of cake I want for breakfast, really. But it was, um. Yeah, that was a that was an interesting flavor anyway, and it looks like Barnaby's having some uh, some chicken for breakfast. And Barnaby, I need to apologize to you. Let me put some music on while I apologize. I need to apologize to you. I forgot to drop you off at the doghouse in the last episode. I forgot to take a dog with me, and I didn't drop Barnaby off at the doghouse, and I feel awful. So I am uh, uh, I'm gonna go, and I'm gonna make up for it today, and uh, you'll see why very soon. Uh, but yeah, before I do that, uh, let's go and uh, head to the the love garden and uh, go and say hello to, to William Beaver as well while we're over there, shall we? And oh, hello, Barnaby. <laughs> How did you get there before me? All right, then. Uh, today to the, the Love Garden, I am adding uh, Elise Bo Borsia. I think that's pronounced uh, Elise Borsia. I think that's how you pronounce it. Uh, anyway, I'm adding Elise because she has been sending me all of these amazing drawings, and there's absolutely loads of them. She's been sending them to me uh, for a very long time, and I absolutely love them. So I wanted to say thank you very much uh, for taking the, the time to do all of these amazing drawings. And welcome to my love garden. Uh, right then, where is um, where's William? Let's go and say her hello to to William properly, shall we? Is he is he still inside of his cave? Come on, we've got lots of games to play today. You can't be changing your outfit again. He's changed his outfit about five times so far this morning. <laughs> oh, I think he's just uh, getting himself a little bit of breakfast and doing some gardening. All uh, right then, uh, what we all need to do. Is go and uh, head over to the uh, the fun land, and I saw you hiding there. <laughs> and uh, go and play my fairy lights game. But I'm going to go and pick a dog which is joining me. And actually, I am not going to pick a dog. I am going to pick all of the dogs. Seeing as I forgot to take a dog with me uh, in the uh, the last episode, I'm going to make it up today by taking every single dog I own with me, uh, and they can be the uh, the spectators of the, the game. And of course, I'm going to be taking mittens as well. I can't leave her uh, sitting in her kitty cat condo alone while I take all of the, the dogs. So, hello everyone! Hello, Wolfpack! <laughs> right, you can all come, and uh, you can all stand up, and uh, you can all come and join me. Come on, Flippy, you can go and stand up as well. Uh, Sherbet and Luna, you can join me. Whoever that is hiding in the the corner and Corey as well. Right, is that everyone? Nope, is that everyone now? I don't want to leave any dogs behind. Right, uh, that's all of them from my doghouse, but don't worry, I know that not all of my dogs spend their time uh, in the uh, the doghouse. I also have some dogs that uh, uh, are in the, the Pick a Pet Pet Shop and the, the Fun Land as well, and uh, you guys, if you want, uh, you can go and uh, head over to the game, and oh, mittens! I forgot mittens! <laughs> right, let's go and uh, climb up here, and uh, we can go and get mittens as well. I can't have Duncan with me without mittens and oh I can hear her are you still in your bedroom no where where is mittens there you are on the the balcony <laughs> uh, you can uh, stand up and uh, you can come and, uh, and join us as well this is um this is quite a rare thing. I can't remember uh, the last time I had all of my dogs and cat uh, with me uh, at the uh, the exact same time. So this is a little bit exciting, actually. Hopefully uh, they have a, a fun, nice day out. Uh, so let's go and uh, grab Fluffy now, uh, who should be here in the, the Pick a Pet Pet Shop. Uh, Fluffy, you're joining us. All the, the dogs are coming. You can stand up. And uh, the only other dog uh, I need to pick up uh, is Gregory Jr. And Gregory Jr. Uh, actually lives at the, the Fun Land, which is handy uh, because that's where we're heading to now. And I'm not going to go and a uh, ride on the, the teleporter uh, today, uh, because yeah, can you imagine me trying to teleport all of these dogs at the same time? That would end up being rather difficult. Just us all fitting in that little room uh, would be uh, quite a challenge. And also, 
Uh, we need to, to head to the uh, the golf course first anyway uh, to go and pick up Gregory Jr. And uh, yeah, I guess I should explain uh, what the uh, the plan for today is. So uh, if you have been watching my last few videos, uh, you would have seen us building my fairy lights game, which is a pretty cool game uh, where you need to, to try and uh, you need to guide a little fairy, uh, which is uh, an experience orb, uh, through a maze of uh, of obstacles or obstacles as I call them. <laughs> and uh, yeah, you need to try and get it to the, the end uh, where there's a light, uh, which you need uh, to light up hence the name fairy lights and uh, we're going to have a little tournament uh, where we're all going to play against each other and then we're going to add up the the point uh, on whether they won or not so let's just say if you win you get a point uh, no, let's say if you win you get two points and then if you lose you get one point because then that way uh, everyone's going to have uh, at least uh, a few points and uh, yeah whoever wins uh, is going to, to pick another game in the the fun land for us to, to play so we're not going to play one game today we are going to play two games uh, but uh, to do that I of course need uh, to head over there and you can see now why uh, I added in a, a teleporter uh, just because of how long it takes <laughs> to get to some of my games I think I've almost got lost here it's just a, a really big maze making my way through this fun land I just know the general direction it is as uh, so let's keep heading that way here we go we have arrived and oh oh yeah there's something else i want to show you as well uh the the end of the last episode i mentioned uh, that we had too much yellow around here so you can see uh, that we've actually changed the um uh, the the space leaves of my uh, berry berry two game as well uh, so it's now cyan wall uh, rather than um uh, yeah rather than yellow wall so then that way uh, everything looks uh, a little bit different so where shall I put the dogs um they can't be too close let's uh let's put them all up here on this little hill shall we if everyone comes up here uh, we can sit them all down up on this hill and then they can spend some time today maybe have themselves a little pork chop picnic <laughs> and some fish for you as well mittens and then they can just uh, enjoy the uh, the the game while we play so. Uh, yep, Sherbet, you got to sit down as well as everyone here. Is this all of the, the dogs? I do believe it is. Do I have any pork chops on me? I've got a, a few. There we go. Oh, there we go. Now you pay attention. <laughs> they all pay attention. Now I've got some pork chops. Right, let's uh, uh, throw some of uh, these down so they can have uh, something to eat. And uh, now uh, we need to go and uh, begin the, the game. And oh, hello, William Beaver. <laughs> uh, right then, uh, seeing as you didn't get to, to play last time, um, Choo Choo, uh, would you like to, to go first? Shall we have the, the first game against each other? Right, would you like to be on the green side or the yellow side the choices are up to you right it looks like choo choo is going to go with his uh, native colored skin <laughs> and uh, go uh, on the the green side and uh, i'm here i'm going to go on the the yellow side so first things first uh, we need to try and um and uh, actually uh, get an experience orb. So if you stand quite far back uh, and be careful to, to break just the, the coal and not the, the glass, uh, yeah, we need to try and get an experience orb. So you can do that now and uh, keep breaking the, the blocks uh, until you uh, have one. And there we go. I've got my one on this side. Uh, so if you go and try and get your fairy, uh, once we uh, we both have one, uh, the, the game can begin. And we're also getting a whole bunch of coal. And there we go. I think he, uh, he has some. Only one choo choo. He's got a whole selection of fairies. It doesn't matter though. You can have uh, more than one. <laughs> right then. We we can begin the first game in three, a two, a one, go, 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 go. Right, so what I need to do now uh, is try and guide my little fairy uh, through these doors. And it looks like I got a really good start then. I did uh, seem to be ahead of Choo Choo, uh, but the way the game's set up, uh, I can't really see how well he's doing uh, until we get closer to the, the end. So I'm getting a little bit stuck here on this first door. And there we go. Oh no, I thought I was through. I thought the, the fairy was through, uh, but then ended up flying back. Let's stand a bit closer. There we go. If I stand a little bit closer, to the the glass i think it has a uh, has more chance of actually being able to to make its way through and oh there we go is it actually through now yes the fairy is uh, definitely through and uh, that's only the the first door i still have a uh, another three doors to get past and this is still only obstacle number one so uh, this does seem to be a bit of a slow start but there we go I've got through the, the next one. That was good. I'm definitely picking up the pace now. And there we go. I got through that one as well. Now it's the, the last door. Can I get through it? Come on quickly. Come on, fairy. Keep up. I want to win. There we go. All right, let's go. Let's just go straight for the, the trap doors. If I'm really fast, I might be able to get straight through them. Oh, no, they're going to start flapping down, though. And I am across. Whoa, that was very, very close. <laughs> right, now uh, it's time for the uh, the water. If I try and stay uh, quite far ahead of the, the fairy, uh, hopefully it's going to follow me. But the water's going to come. Uh, but hopefully I can battle the, the, uh, the current and uh, try and push past. Nope, it looks like I'm kind of momentarily uh, stuck there. Uh, but it's okay. As soon as the, the water goes, uh, I need to, to rush as quickly as I can and uh, try and get to the, the next area. If I'm really quick, I might
might get past the, the dispenser for the next water, but oh no, the water came. But it's okay. I can kind of trap my uh, my fairy uh, up against the uh, the glass here. And how's Choo Choo doing? Oh, I can't see him. He's either further behind than I am or further ahead. I don't know if he's uh, up there or not got round here yet. But now I need to, to guide it to here. And there we go. I just about got it past. And oh, Choo Choo's not up here yet, which means I am in the lead. Despite my uh, my slow start with the uh, the doors, I have been able to, to take the lead. And now uh, I need to go and try and guide my fairy uh, across some of these bridges. And I've not done it on the, the yellow side before. So uh, let's uh, let's give it a go. It's actually quite hard to, to see the bridge because it's uh, a yellow background and then a, a yellow bridge. I'm kind of just overwhelmed with yellow. But uh, I seem to be going uh, pretty slow and steady getting it over the bridge. I really don't want to, to fall down uh, because if I do, then I've got to go and try and push it up the uh, the blocks again and uh, yeah try and uh, get it the uh, uh, try and do it again from the the start so I'd rather be slow and careful and as seen as Choo Choo's not here yet uh, there's no reason for uh, for me to rush uh, because I should be able to, to take my time and uh, if I see that he uh, he gets to this section uh, then I can just go and try and speed up uh, even quicker than I'm going already but I've nearly got across to the other bridge oh no don't fall don't fall there we go I did it I was able to get to the, the other side and now it's just the the home stretch I just need to get around these uh, final two corners and then I have lit the the first fairy light and if I do do that uh, as I said I will then get two points which uh, will hopefully uh, be able to, to put me uh, in the uh, in the the lead and then after this uh, we're going to have um, uh, we're going to have William Beaver uh, going up uh, against Choo Choo and then at the the end uh, I'm going to be going up against William Beaver and then we'll hopefully have ourselves a, a final winner. We could uh, have a draw as well. If it works out uh, we could actually end up having a draw as well. Uh, in that case uh, I guess we'll just pick a, a game to, together for us to play and I still haven't seen Choo Choo. I reckon he's got stuck uh, on one of the, the obstacles. So uh, once I've finished I'll go and see how well he's doing but first I need to light up the, the light. I have one until the lights lit up but there we go <laughs> I was able to, to do it my fairy has got to the the end and there, look at all the dogs look at all of the, the dogs watching what are they looking at I think they're watching Choo Choo let's see how things are going oh no oh he got stuck he got stuck on the um on this section oh on the um on the trap doors flapping oh this is a tricky part it is quite difficult uh, to get past fast enough you need to wait until they've just flapped and then you need to go as fast as you can here we go oh I think you're going too far ahead Choo Choo that's the problem I think if you stay closer to them uh, then they move quicker I think that might have been where you fell but sadly Choo Choo it is the uh, the end of this round but don't worry uh, because you are going to be playing again immediately but this time uh, you are going to be going up against William Beaver so uh, let's go and uh, get the uh, the game set up again. Uh, if we go and put some uh, some coal back there, and uh, if we just don't worry about this um uh, these experience orbs for now anyway, because uh, yeah they're stuck in a, a pit anyway, so it doesn't really matter too much. <laughs> right then, it looks like um uh, William Beaver's going on the the yellow side. Uh, Choo Choo wants to stick with the the green side. So if you go and break away the uh, the coal ore, uh, we need to wait until you both have at least one orb yet. And there we go. It looks like William Beaver has his orb. Uh, Choo Choo just needs to try and get his. And there we go. Uh, he has a, a couple on his side as well. So you can begin the round in three, a two, a one, go, 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 go. Right, while they're playing, I might go and sit here with my dogs and try and watch her here for a little bit, shall we? <laughs> it looks like, um... William Beaver is the uh, uh, is taking the, the lead at the, the beginning, but these doors can be really tricky. And if I remember, uh, William Beaver actually did have some trouble with these doors uh, in the uh, the last time we played this at the end of the, the last episode. So this uh, might be an opportunity uh, for Choo Choo to take an early lead, but they seem to be pretty equal so far. Uh, they seem to be uh, just about uh, the uh, the same side. Oh no, look, William Beaver has made it through. He has got uh, past the, the doors and now he needs to get past the, the trap doors he needs to be patient here and uh, wait for them to flap and then go immediately and oh there we go he knew he almost went too early then <laughs> but that's good that's some good speed there is he going to get across to the other side though and he's done it he's across the the trap doors right uh, let's go around to the the other side and uh, see how well choo choo's doing let's see uh, if he's uh, doing any better than last time and oh no he's back down to the pit again <laughs> look how many orbs he has now right so he needs to wait and then he needs to go each side uh, is exactly equal uh, so you do have the the same amount of time oh this is looking better see he's staying much closer to his fairy and he made it because he stayed closer to his fairy uh, he was able to, to make it uh, all the way to the the end and now they are both on the the water section uh, looks like a uh, William Beaver uh, is slightly ahead as he got to this section first uh, but he's probably going to get stuck uh, by the the water yet again and oh no he's, he's getting pushed back you need to get closer William Beaver otherwise the the water could uh, push it back to the the start uh, Choo Choo uh, seems to be doing a, a very good job here and actually uh, they're almost neck and neck despite 
William Beaver uh, getting to, to this section way before Choo Choo. They seem to be almost in the same position. Oh no, but look, uh, Billy Beaver has a head up to the, the top, uh, but so's Choo Choo. This is completely neck and neck as they're making their way uh, to the... Um, Oh uh, yeah, to the the bridges. I want to uh, to make sure I stay far back here uh, because I don't want to to influence the the fairies. I don't want them to to get pulled uh, to me. Uh, so I'm just going to stay very far back. I tell you what, I'll go and stand all the the way over here uh, by the uh, the lamps. And is there is there a zombie with the the doggies? <laughs> He seems to be pretty peaceful, so we'll leave him there. Right, uh, let's stand here and see how they're doing. It looks like Billy Beaver uh, is uh, slightly ahead of Choo Choo, but only slightly. They are still almost neck and neck. This is by far the uh, the closest game uh, of fairy lights we have had yet. And to be honest, they're exactly neck and neck now. I can't pick a winner. Oh, looks like Billy Beaver was slightly quicker getting on to the, the bridge, uh, as Choo Choo is just getting on now. Uh, but we still have the uh, the final two corners to, to go uh, before the, the very end. And Choo Choo uh, seems to be uh, catching up quite nicely as well. I honestly don't know uh, who is going to, to win. If Choo Choo uh, wants to, to win at all, he has to win this game uh, just because he lost the uh, the last game with me. Uh, Billy Beaver, if he wins this and beats me, uh, he is going to, to win outright. So there's uh, certainly still a, a lot to, to play for. And now I'm going to have to watch very carefully uh, to see which light gets lit up first. It's not just about which orb gets there first. Uh, the, the light actually needs needs to, to light up. We could even uh, end up with a, a draw here. Look, they're in the exact same position after all of this time. <laughs> They've ended up in the exact same position. But who is going to, to light the, the light first? Neither of them uh, are lit up. Uh, let me try and stand over here. Uh, so then that way I'll be able to, to see uh, which light gets lit up first. And who's it going to be? Who's it going to be? It was Choo Choo. It was Choo Choo. Only just though. Choo Choo just about was able to get it lit up first. <laughs> Despite being slightly behind or Almost the entire round, he was able to get the, the light first. It was just the, the final corner uh, that Billy Beaver struggled with. And there we go. Now the, the light is lit up. So well done, Choo Choo. Congratulations. Uh, you won round number two. But now... It's going to be my turn against William Beaver. So what this means is, if I win, then I am the, the outright winner. Uh, but if William Beaver wins, then we have a three-way tie. <laughs> so it's, uh, yeah, as I said, certainly all still to, to play for. So, uh, oh, looks like uh, uh, William Beaver's going to go and try and deal with some of the uh, the googlies first. <laughs> I think the uh, the coast is clear for now. And uh, right then, uh, let's go and get set up for the, the next round. So, uh, uh, Billy Beaver, uh, would you like to, to pick... Uh, which colour you would like to, to play on. Are you going to stick with yellow or are you going to go for, for green? Right, uh, looks like uh, Billy Beaver wants to go to the, the green side. Uh, so let's go and uh, try and get ourselves uh, an experience orb, shall we? There we go. It uh, looks like uh, William's already got his. Uh, so let's go and uh, break a little bit of this coal uh, until I'm able to, to get mine. It is a bit of a waste of coal, but oh, I accidentally picked that one up. <laughs> uh, but yeah, I think it's uh, worth it for the, the fun game. And oh, do I have one? Yes, I have my fairy and it looks like a strong and powerful fairy if you ask me. Uh, right then, let's begin the, the final round of Fairy Lights in a three, a two, a one, go, 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 go. Right. I want to be really, really fast that time. And whoa, look at that speed. That was a sprint to start this round. And this is where I struggled most uh, last time. And I don't know the best strategy. Oh, look, I got through. I got through the first door already. Right, this is going brilliantly so far. Can I get through the next door? Come on, come on, fairy. Come to me, come to me. Yes, no, it's not through. I looked like it was through, but then it got knocked back by the door. Come on, fairy. Is it actually through this time? I'm not sure if it's... Oh, it keeps getting knocked back. There we go. If I stand back a bit, uh, it's made it a little bit uh, easier. And I did hear an arrow being fired then, I think thing. Uh, hopefully there's not googlies attacking. You might need to, to guard us, Choo Choo. Actually, we might need to guard you. You seem to be getting attacked. <laughs> right then, on to the, the trap doors. This is where most people have struggled, but I've done a co- Oh no, I fell straight down. I fell straight down. I went too early. I don't know why I went too early. And oh, there's a skeleton attacking me, Choo Choo. Please help me. <laughs> right then, let's go and try and get my uh, fairy back to the, uh, the beginning, shall we? Uh, I've lost uh, a lot of time because of that. I went too early. I didn't wait for the, um, I didn't wait for the, the trap doors to flap, and then I fell down, but it's okay. I'm I'm making my way across now. If I don't fall now, I still have a, a good chance of winning this. And there we go, straight across, plenty of time left. And I can't see uh, Billy Beaver at all. That means he's either still uh, further back than I am or further ahead. And hello, Corey. <laughs> what are you doing in the game? You can't play. <laughs> Why did Corey go there? Okay, it looks like uh, Corey's decided uh, uh, to be my mascot and uh, cheer me on. Thanks for that, Corey. <laughs> and oh, look, oh, look, there's Billy Beaver. We're neck and neck again, right? 
Come on, fairy. Come on, fairy. Quickly, go and fight the water. Fight the water. Come on. Come to me. That's it. Come to my voice. Come to me. <laughs> there we go. Let's try and get past the water before it comes out again. Come on, fairy. Quickly, quickly, quickly. Can I do it? Yes. I was able to get past the water and now I can climb up top. But oh no. Oh no. Look at Billy Beaver. He's ahead of me. Where's the fairy? Right. The fairy's coming through. I have to be really, really fast if I want to, to win this. If I try and stay quite close to the, the fairy, I think that's the way to make it go quickest. Uh, but oh no. I think Billy Beaver's ahead of me. All right. Let's go now and try and make my way across the bridge. If I just stay exactly in the, the middle and uh, walk quite quickly, I should be able to, to get the uh, the ferry across, make sure it doesn't fall down. And it looks like uh, uh, William Beaver is slightly ahead of me. Remember, if I win this, I am going to be the, the outright winner. Uh, but if William wins it, uh, then it's going to be a three-way tie. So this could uh, still go either way. And oh, look, it looks like he's slightly uh, ahead of me. Come on, fairy. Come on, you've done so well up until now. Please go faster. Come on, quickly, 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 quickly. And across to the other side. And now it's just time for the, the final stretch. If I stay close to the, the inside, uh, then that way I should be able to go slightly quicker. And uh, we need to uh, watch carefully. Uh, to see uh, whose light lights up first. Uh, Choo Choo, uh, do you want to, to drop up? And uh, then you can keep watching the uh, the lights and uh, you can let me know uh, who lights up first just in case I can't see it. Right, uh, let's go and uh, try and go across this final stretch. I think we're pretty much neck and neck now. Can I light it first though? Can I light it first? This is so unbelievably close. I can't believe it's all come down to this. <laughs> well, that's a good idea, jumping up on the, the ledge here. I think it's still neck and neck. I don't think uh, Billy Beaver's light is lit up yet. Oh, and here we go. Go on around the corner. Come on, fairy, quick as you can. Quick as you can. I can't see. Is his light lit up? Oh, his light isn't up yet, but Eva's mine. Come on, fairy. Follow me. Follow me, fairy. Follow me, fairy. Come on, quickly. Quickly, fairy. Yes, I did it. My light was on first. <laughs> By about a second, I was able to win. <laughs> I can't believe that. What a comeback at the end. And I'm sorry, William Beaver. I'm so sorry. It was such a close game. It could have gone either way. Both of your games could have, but that was still jolly good fun none the, the less and because I won uh, that means I get to pick a uh, another mini game for us to to play and seeing as there's three of us uh, three of us how about we go and play desert drop so uh, I'll leave all of my doggies here uh, to enjoy the the rest of their picnic let's go and uh, uh, give them some uh, some more chicken as well so they can go and eat that and uh, yeah while they're enjoying that uh, we can go and uh, play some desert drops. And actually, I should probably get Corey out of the, the game. How did you even get in there? He's sitting inside glass, isn't he? <laughs> Let's try and uh, break Corey out. And uh, Corey, you can come and join us because why not? He was just very curious about what was going on inside of the, the game. Uh, so yeah, if you haven't seen the, the desert drop game, uh, this is a game uh, where we need to try and gather up as much cactus as we can and throw it down some little coloured tubes. And uh, whoever can get the, the most wins. The difficult thing is the fact that while we we're doing that the ground is going to be burning away and dropping under our feet so I've pressed the, the button if everyone goes and heads upstairs now uh, Corey's gonna have to stay downstairs because it's a, a very dangerous game there's cactus and fire all over the place <laughs> so yeah I'm gonna be orange uh, Choo Choo you can be green of course and uh, William Beaver uh, you can be blue uh, right then let's go and, uh, and begin the game you can hear uh, that there's a fire uh, being launched uh, underneath us and uh, that is going to be uh, burning away the ground. And Choo Choo, you gotta, you got to jump in. Uh, you got to come in and join the game. So uh, what we need to do now is uh, go and try and grab all of the, the cactus, just like I did. And then you throw it down uh, into your little hole. So mine's the orange one, uh, which is over here. And out, I keep running into all of it. And oh, I nearly fell down then. There we go. I got to go and throw it in here. So I there uh, was able to, to get three points. Uh, but if you fall down, uh, then you're out. Uh, then you are out of the game. And oh, can I steal these? There we go. I was able to, to steal some of the, uh, the cactus there from Billy. And all there's loads over here. I got absolutely loads. Oh, Choo Choo got about half of it there, though. Uh, but I got the, the rest. Uh, so let's go and uh, throw this in here. I think that was a, a very good start for me. But I want to make sure that I'm careful uh, to, to stay up and uh, not drop down. And then the game... Oh, oh, nearly. I nearly fell down as soon as I said that. <laughs> and then the, the game is over. I want the, uh, the ground to stop dropping. And oh, oh, there was some right behind Choo Choo there and he didn't notice. I can grab that and throw it in. And then there's another one over here. Oh, look, there's loads. There's loads of cactus all over the place here. Let's grab this and uh, try and get get it in before the ground drops. I was just about able to get it in there and throw it in. I think I might have a world record breaking score here. I don't think I've ever uh, done so well at this game before. I always enjoy this game, but I've never been particularly good at it. <laughs> it looks like there's um, 
A bunch of cactus over there. No, oh, no, I jumped down. I jumped down trying to, to make my way to it. That wasn't good. And oh, it looks like uh, William Beaver uh, has fallen down as well. Uh, so it's all up to, to Choo Choo now. He's allowed to, to carry on until either the uh, the fires stop burning uh, or if he falls down himself. But once you've fallen down, uh, any cactus you may be holding, you're not allowed to use. And oh, there we go. It looks like the um, it looks like the, the game is over. We have all fallen down. So let's uh, count up the, the score. Choo Choo had 14. That is an amazing score as well. Well, uh, William Beaver uh, has 15, even better. <laughs> this is so close. And I have 14. That was such a close game. But William Beaver is the winner. <laughs> yeah, even though you didn't win the, the Fairy Lights game, you were able to make it up and win the, the Desert Drop game. But sadly, we have just about run out of time in this episode. Hopefully uh, you uh, enjoyed this uh, fun-filled episode of us playing lots of mini games with my friends. Uh, there'll be a link in the description uh, to the next episode of My Lovely World once it's, on, uh, once it's online. Uh, but for now, I want to thank you all very much for watching and I will see you all later. Bye!